you guys. I am back and I forgot to turn on that lamp or that light behind me, but it's okay. I will be doing my makeup today. I'm just going to scoot you in a little closer. Um, I'm starting with nothing. I already just put primer. So I'm bare faced. I have a few blemishes, but I'm going to cover those up right quick. I'm going to be using my Fenty Beauty Concealer in color 370. This is, uh, this is how I conceal my flaws. <laughs> how are y'all this morning or this afternoon? I don't even know what time it is. My kids are off from school another week from spring break, so they're happy about that. They're still asleep. I woke up, got a lot of stuff done, and now I'm coming to you guys with a makeup video. How are y'all? Okay, so I just kind of spot conceal like that. This is really good concealer, so you don't need too, too much. In fact, even if you didn't want to put foundation on, you could probably just get away with spot concealing if you're not going anywhere <laughs> special, you know. But I like to put on foundation if I'm going to be like on camera or going somewhere where I'm going to be out for a while and I want to look good. It's your birthday. Happy birthday, Vicky. She said it's her birthday. Everybody tell Vicky happy birthday. She's, she's turning 21 again. All right. So I could I could probably get away with that, but I'm gonna go and put some more of my foundation on just to even out the um the uh yeah just to even it out. I got the foundation in the same color, 370. Um I hope so. Yeah, 370. So I just put a little bit on the spot. <laughs> my birthday week was awesome y'all thank y'all everyone who sent me gifts for my wish list on amazon thank you everybody who sent me cash apps and birthday wishes and donations and all that i felt so loved so i appreciate you guys making my birthday week memorable <laughs> sprinkle sprinkle okay, okay. this sponge you need a sponge like this? I got this. It's by Kiss. Oh, I'll just take it out of the package. I got this. It's by Kish. Kiss. It's cheaper than Real Techniques and Beauty Blender. And look, it, it was only $2.99 at the beauty supply store or I don't know where, wherever they sell Kiss products. So you can get a really good sponge for cheap and it's the same quality, I say. Okay, so now that I uh, got that on, you can put a little bit on your neck, but I have on a scarf and a jacket, so I kind of don't want to get that on me down there, so I'm going to skip all of that. Um, you have no clue on how to start wearing makeup? Go to Sephora and tell them that, and they will help you. All you got to do is go to Sephora or Ulta and tell them you don't know how to wear makeup. Can you help me? Can you help me? You need a good moisturizer and take care of your skin first because you need a good palette for your makeup to go on. Okay, so now that I have that on, I'm going to, I'm going to set my face with this Too Faced Born This Way Multitude Complexion Powder. And this is in warm sand. And it looks like that. So, oh, I have some of my brushes over here today and I forgot. So this comes with a sponge, but I like to use brushes. And I'm just gonna kind of buff that in. You like that powder, Rosalina? Uh, I know. I use it in my purse when I need to do touch-ups or quick makeup look without having to go home and put on a bunch of makeup. This is also like a foundation. If you you can build it, it's like a powder foundation. You can build it up. It gives you a little bit extra coverage as well. 
so you can build it up to your liking. It makes it look natural. It's not too too much, so I do like that. Okay. Um, in this Corona time, they closed everywhere in the Netherlands restaurant, bars, museum. <laughs> Any date ideas? Yeah. I mean, here's my thing. You're going to look real desperate out there in the coronavirus time trying to date. That's all I have to say about that. Just work on your makeup skills, catch up on some videos, go to the, you know, shop, go to the store, shop online. I'm not really afraid to go out and do things, but I mean, I'm not going to be suggesting women go out to freestyle in this desperate time. It look bad. So I'm, I have my own Level Up Cosmetics eyebrow pencil, which you guys can get on my Poshmark store. And I'm just going to be using that today to brush my sparse eyebrows. I did pluck a lot of them off so that I could shape them correctly. Um, I'm not going to use the big magnified mirror because that will just keep me here for hours. So I'm using the color number five in black, and I usually mix it with a brown if I have it. So you bought my face one. So excited. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. I hope you enjoy it. You know, there's a lot of people buying the silver right now because of the Corona. <laughs> but yeah, that is great too. So I just kind of outline the, what I want to look like. And I just fill it in. I brush it up first to look more natural. If I do heavier makeup, I have to darken my my brows. But if I don't, I can keep them kind of natural and light. So we'll see what happens. You are so quick. I know. I've been doing this for years. But I am old, and I've been doing this for years. So. It's easy for me. I think like once people get into the habit of doing something every day, it's fast and easy and it's not like a big deal or a chore anymore. I know I hate cleaning up and doing dishes because I don't like it. And I see people do that like it's nothing. So <laughs> I guess it's what you like to do, huh? Or what you've been doing for years and just used to doing. So y'all see the difference already? Just in a little eyebrow pencil. And then you can, I have this NYX um, professional eye primer in like the, the skin color. And then I just go under it and clean it up really nice. And that's it, y'all. Kind of help the tail end a little bit. Then I prime your dusty dented your brand new car. Why are you with a dusty baby? And he gave you a hundred dollars on the spot until he gets paid. Should I block him and count my losses because it's whatever? Girl, I wouldn't even be with a dusty, so I don't know. <laughs> Honestly, like what good can they bring you? If if you're not benefiting from your relationship, why are you in it? That's my thing, you know. You, it, It's like working for free. Why are you going to work if you ain't getting paid, baby? All right, next brow. Y'all love my eyebrow brush, isn't it? It's just wonderful. And they come in different colors. So if you have light brown brows, if you have dark brown brows, if you have black brows, there's... A regular brown for those who don't know what they got or you can just mix them all up I like them because they last a long time and they have that slanted uh, tip I always have problems with this brow more than the other I don't know how many of you guys have the same issue but this is my problem brow. Maybe it's because it's on my left side. I don't know. I'm not left-handed. How do you control 
you're jealous with your husband being around other I don't really care. My husband ain't around other hotties. Plus, I look better than all of the women that he ever goes around anyway. So. <laughs> you really can't control a person at all. All you can do is be confident in yourself and keep yourself looking good so that if you need to replace him, you can. I mean, that's all you could basically do. <laughs> it's like, I can go get another one too, baby. You ain't the only one. So, you know, keep options available to you by keeping yourself looking cute all the time. So if, if you just ever decide, look, I don't want to be in this situation anymore, I'm going to go get me another one who's not surrounded by all these women all the time. Mm -hmm. Your life is what you make it. If you don't want to put up with something, don't put up with it. If you don't care, then reap all the benefits that you can. So spend all his money so whoever he gets is going to be definitely a pick Bisha. If you really have nothing to spend on her. <laughs> Or keep his money tied up in investments, businesses, your expensive shopping habits, whatnot, whatever. Corona, corona has ruined freestyling. Well, use it as taking the time to better yourself so when you get back out there, you can catch bigger fish. Okay? Use this time. To learn how to do your makeup better, to get better game, catch up on the videos, lose some weight. Because, you know, if you need to lose weight, go to the, uh, do some exercise videos. I don't know, because they probably close the gyms. You know, take some time to better yourself at this time. So when you get back out there, you get better results. Just take a little break. You'll be all right. Call all the sugar daddies and tell them. I need to order groceries online and all the stores are out of food and I can only order from online and I need some cash. No cash, Abby. <laughs> They'll be like, oh, no. Don't go out there. Here. Here's some money. You know, I need to learn how to use the coronavirus to get paid. I ran out of the toilet paper. The only place that's selling it is online and I need to order in bulk. Otherwise, they're not selling it. <laughs> See? I gotta get get some games, some Corona game, I'll say. I might do a video on that, how to scam during the law. Well, that might be illegal. I might have to use different language or different words. How to thrive in the dating and freestyling during this time. <laughs> Cry. I am out of toilet paper. I have a sign in my bathroom that says you don't know what you have till it's gone and there's like a roll of toilet paper on it. I got it from like some home decor section in a store like months ago. Mm -hmm. So now I'm just evening up my brows because sometimes I don't draw them on quite even and I have to kind of come in here and get it together. This little sparse area. Make it look like a natural. Mm -hmm. All right, now I can clean it up. I'll be all right. So what are you guys doing? Are y'all off work? Do y'all have to go to work? Or what? Like, what's going on with you? Because I have no idea what y'all are doing. Am I from the Caribbean? Um, my dad is uh, from Puerto Rico, so he's from the Caribbean, or would that be the Bahamas, or would that be the Caribbean Ocean, or Caribbean Sea? <laughs> mm -hmm. 
No, I'm not from there. I was born, raised right here in Texas. Mm -hmm. Okay. This one's a little thicker right here, so I'm going to go ahead and thin that out so I can even out on both sides. So you just kind of play even. You got to even stuff out. So this is good enough for me for now. And if, it's, if I need to fix it later, I'll fix it later. But I'm not afraid to go out either. I've been asked on a date, but since they closed, where can you have dinner? Da, 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 da. They're not closed everywhere. Find somewhere where you can go. Look it up online. Who's open during the coronavirus? A lot of times, like, restaurants will send out emails or put, put it on their website if they're open to close. So you just have to find it. Thank you. Now, this is my brow so far. Let's clean this edge up. All right. Now for the eyeshadow. I'm going to use the palette that my daughter Layla bought me for my birthday. She's so sweet. It's the Sephora Eye Stories palette in Fresh Florals. I'll use some other palettes too. Like this is the CoverGirl Rain eyeshadow palette that they had a while back. I'm going to use that too. So I have on like florals today, a denim jacket, and some army green pants like paper bag pants and some sparkly shoes. So I'm going to, I'm going to go for some color today because I can. Uh -huh. And I'm going to use my brush collection by Level Up Cosmetics. Y'all going to get these too. Mm -hmm. Do you ever face the front of your brows? Face the front? Um, I don't know what that means. That Does that mean like put it more thin. Yeah, I do lots of things with my brows, depending on my mood. Yeah. It depends on my mood. Sometimes I want them very villainous and sharp. To scare people. No. Just depends on the makeup look that I'm doing. So I'm using my Level Up Nude uh, Nudes palette. And this is on my Poshmark. This is just a nice nudes palette. And I'm just going to go in with a base coat using this color here. Thank you. Okay. Girl, don't be out in this coronavirus trying to get... But yeah, I, I definitely agree. If they ask you out on a date, it's okay to go. But don't be out there looking like, I'm desperate. <laughs> you can go online and see. You can set something up for when this blows over if you date online. I mean, now would be a good time to see how it how it's gonna change now that everybody's stuck in the house. Okay, so might be a, a little bit different now that everyone's stuck. I'm not stuck. I'm going out shopping ahead of my dog food, cat food. I ordered groceries online, but they won't ship them until Wednesday or have them delivered till Wednesday because of all the stuff that's going on. So I have to actually go out and get what I actually need. It was supposed to come yesterday, but they postponed it. So I'm gonna do a yellow right here on my lid because I'm just dying to get into this yellow. It's like a pollen color yellow. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna do whatever I need to do. I'm not scared of coronavirus. I know what coronavirus is, so I might do a whole, I have a whole video on my other channel about taxes. I'm not afraid of it, so I'm going out and do what I need to do. Okay, so this is cute. It's like a pollen color yellow. If you're going to go anywhere to freestyle, go shopping. Go to places where they sell stuff. That way it doesn't look like you're trying too hard. And if someone just at, happens to be out, they happen to be out and talk to you. So do more casual freestyling, like shopping or just being in the you know normal places, but look extra good. I have a dog. Yeah, a little chihuahua. 
My neighbors have a big dog. <laughs> I have a little dog. All right, so I leave that on. Um, and I'm going to go in for the transition color. Okay, well, I guess I can use this one. So my transition color, I'm going to do this really pretty color in Florist. It's like a mauve brownish pink. I'm just going to go up there. It's really pretty. So it looks brighter on than it is in the palette, though. Thank you. They closed the mall. Really? That's crazy. I'm going to go drive around and see what's open and what's closed in my neck of the woods. Mm -hmm. Did I scrap for some toilet paper? Where I was, there was stacks of toilet paper. No one was going crazy like that over here. Um, Layla, my daughter, she was grabbing toilet paper because she wanted to put it on TikTok as some, you know, a funny TikTok. So she got like three big things of toilet paper, but we already had like two at the house already. Like we always stay stocked up. <laughs> Thank you. So I'm, not, I'm just kind of blending this out a little bit. Um, I love this brush because it's like so fluffy and easy to blend. This is my brush collection. Level up. Okay. So I got that on. Okay, now for the crease color. Now you don't always have to do a crease color. You can if you want. I mean, I do sometimes. I'm gonna go in with this pink. It's called Orchid. And it just gives it a little bit more definition. I really like the florals because it's like, it's not super bright, but it's more subtle and it's springtime. It just reminds you of blooming flowers. I'm gonna blend that up a little bit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is the palette Layla got me. I'm using it. It's the Sephora palette and I Stories palette and Flesh, Fresh Florals. That's the name of the palette. Fresh Florals. I like those colors on you. I'm in Chicago right now. I'm visiting from Dallas and they shut down restaurants and bars today. Wow. That's not good. I don't, I think uh, where I live is less reactive. They're not reacting as crazy at some places. So I'm pretty lucky. It's like a lot of places are still open. Okay, so now I'm gonna go back and retouch that yellow because it kind of faded away. This is called Sunflower. Just gonna retouch it. I might put some glitter on it too. Not some glitter, but some sheen on it to kind of make it stand out a little bit because it's matte. There's mattes and sheens in this palette. But I have a really pretty gold um, sheen color in this CoverGirl Rain palette that I bought a while back. See? So that will go perfect. This is called Money Maker. <laughs> so that's what it looks like. Money Maker, y'all. So I'm just going to dot it on there. Give it a little bit of sheen. It's more of a gold sheen. It's not super, super shiny, but it just gives it a little bit of definition and pop in person. So it's not super matte. You can still see like a little shine on it. All right. Didn't really make too much of a difference, but this is. The subtle details make a difference up close. It doesn't really pay off on the camera. Okay, so now for the under, um, you can line it with a color. I don't know if I should do like a blue or green to kind of set this off or just to stay neutral. What do y'all think? 
And then I need to do my highlight too. I also have this Mercury Retrograde Huda palette. I could put something. I might do like this purple. I should read it. Hmm. This blue is pretty, but that might be too much. You said neutral, keep it neutral. Yeah, I agree. Hmm. Green. I think green would be kind of cute too. But it'll probably end up looking more white because it's a pastel green. Unless I put this glittery green and dignify it. Partial to purple. Green or purple. Okay. How long do I think this is going to take to go back to normal? Probably two, three weeks. We'll be back to normal. Places are going to start opening up next week because they're going to be losing money. And then, like, forget this. I risk the corona. <laughs> They're going to be like, I'm using this green. They're going to be like, forget this. I need my money. Corona or not. If people don't play about their money. <laughs> I'm serious. They'll just be like, oh, well. I don't know nobody with it, so, you know, come on through. <sighs> like, until I know somebody with it personally, I'm not really super worried about it. They shut school down. Yeah, they sure did. Kids are so happy. All right, so now I have to do a highlight color. Uh, we're just taking it like a vacation, y'all. Like, whatever. We're happy. You do know someone with it? Oh, that's not good. Okay, Um, I don't know anybody with it. But I don't know too many people, so probably that's why. I don't know anybody with it online either. I'm using this color right here. It's called Dew, like the morning dew. Look how pretty and reflective it is. Do what you want to do. There ain't no rules, it's up to you. <laughs> She's getting better. Oh, okay. Well, that's wonderful. I'm glad she's getting better. Okay. Just kind of blending these together so it doesn't look so harsh. All right. Ta -da. That's that. Now, I, I feel like I should do some liner. Or some type of, I don't know. Sasha been using that, it's probably almost gone. She loves my Level Up liner because she likes how it, um, that you're able to draw with a little wand. Maybe I should use it. If she has any left for me, I'll have to go grab another one if she doesn't. Oh. She uses this while she plays in my makeup. Mm -hmm. Let me concentrate on putting this on so that it doesn't look crazy. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> okay, done with that eye. I love this. Um, I actually, um, have this on my Poshmark store and also a lot of you guys were asking about if I have any color the reds left in my Poshmark lipsticks they're only available in the vintage collection where you have to get all the pieces so I still have Siren and Rake Charmer and the natural colors still available so if y'all like that bright pretty vintage red 
they are only available in the collection, which means you get liner, um, mascara, eyeshadow palette, all of that. Um, you get this really cute vintage speaker in pink or blue, whichever one you'd like. You get a set of my pink vintage looking brushes. You get six things basically. So it's worth it. Okay, and you get all the lipstick colors um, in the vintage collection. Okay, so now I'm just putting this liner on. This is also waterproof too, so that's why I also love it. Waterproof liquid liner. Y'all, I'm feeling my spring boho urge come back. So I'm gonna spice it up this year and do looks boho. Like the Gucci florals and the, the Chloe. And the spells of the Gypsy Collective type. Um, Lux Boho. So I have to thicken this side up a little bit because this side's a little thick. I'm not going to go crazy on the wing today. So. There. Ta -da! All right. My wings need help. Well, it's easy to do with this because this is so little. You can control the amount that's, that you put on it. And you can just kind of sketch it on. Okay. Now, some people do the lower lash line and liner, but I'm going to skip that. I'll just put mascara on it to make it look. Make it look good. Where's my mascara? Um, I'm gonna be using my Level Up mascara today. This lengthens your lashes. It puts like that extra fiber on it so that they look longer naturally. If you have sparse lashes and you don't like, oh, I forgot. Also, in the vintage collection, you get lashes too. So you will not be without. Magnetic lashes. Actually, we get magnetic lashes. What else are y'all doing? While y'all are. Are y'all off work? Y'all never told me that. Oops. Are they making y'all come into work? You were blessed with long eyelashes, burying the red beard. Lucky you. So is Sasha, my daughter. All right, so now that I have that on, I'm gonna come in so you guys can see how it really is working. Look at that, you see how it's building on the lashes? And then when you put your second coat on, it builds upon that. You don't work good for you, <laughs> freedom. All right. All right. I like the little bottom lashes, how they stand out. And you can build on them with this fibrous lash mascara. Maybe if I curled my top Lashes would look longer. They look longer from the side though. All right. Now I need to contour y'all because I don't have a, I need to contour. So I'm gonna use my Urban Decay Naked Skin Contour. 
I go into this color and I mix these two. Go down here first, get like the extra off under my chin. Cause I'll go overboard if I don't get the extra off and it just helps thin your face. Drinking coffee, making break breakfast. Oh, honey, you still look so young. Thank you. I try. <laughs> I'm like, look young, look young. Then I look young. I mentally told myself I wasn't not gonna age very fast at all. I ain't gonna age fast. At all. I'm still look young as long as I can. I think it's mind over matter too. Somewhat. And plus, I'm around kids all day. You know, being around, you know, younger people also helps you stay youthful. Plus, I'm vegan or plant based, whatever y'all want to call me. Uh -huh. And yeah, you said weight ages people. Yeah, and I lost weight for sure. You want a quick fix to look younger, and you're if you're not super skinny already, losing weight helps. Unless you have saggy skin, like on your face, then it might make you look older. So it just depends. So I'm just kind of blending, blending that in, and I'll take this fluffy brush and blend even more. I I said I'm vegan, vegan or plant based. Yes, I. Vegan or plant based? Mm hmm. So I just blend that in like that. Found this really cool vegan food food truck on my side of town. It looks pretty good. Okay. Now I need some blush. What I eat and cook in a day, y'all will be bored. Can I film it? I could just tell y'all. I might think about it. Let's see. Today I ate. I thought I no, I didn't even get to eat it. I just had coffee today. Haven't. Oh, why am I using this brush for the blush? Oh, yeah, I grabbed the wrong brush. I haven't eaten yet. Um. So I don't know what I'm gonna eat. I like hummus, chips, like tortilla chips, hummus. Um, I do a lot of, um, Asian food because a lot of it is vegan or plant-based or Mexican. All right. So I'm using this one. Wanted to NARS palette. And I'm just kind of using this color. Okay, now I'm going to go in for my highlight. There's a highlighter that I want to use, but I can't remember which one it was. Oh, well, I just use what I have available. <laughs> like, look at my fingertips. Improvise. Okay. Sasha steals my highlighter, too. She loves my makeup. Um, well, I guess that's good. If it's that's a good sign, that's good makeup. Gosh, I love it. All right, I'm gonna go in. Oh, this is a bronzer. Is she better? I had got my booty. Looks like she got some of my Fenty as well. This child. Wow. Gosh, be. Boosting me. Okay. Oh, okay. She has it back here where it's not supposed to be. I'm going to use my Level Up Cosmetics highlighter in Bahama, Bahamian Goddess. She. Spicy potato tacos. Oh my God, that sounds so good. <laughs> so I'm hitting my cheekbones with my Bahamian Goddess. This is also, I reduced the price on this as well. 
So if you were thinking about getting it, I just reduced the price on my Poshmark store. Since it's about to be spring, you know, about to start going on vacation when this coronavirus thing lifts up. And y'all need to look extra glowy and bronzy for your vacay pics. You'll see. So it's not too light and it just makes you have like a natural glow. And I'm just going to blend it a little bit. And these are available. Uh, I think I have a few left on my Etsy store. If you also want to get them via Etsy. These only. I might start putting more makeup on my Etsy. It just depends. Okay, so flawless skin now. Thanks to my Level Up Bohemian Goddess. Okay, so like if you're wearing like something that shows your neck off, this even really looks good on your decollete top. There we go. Get that, get that going. Okay, so now that that's all done, I will need a lip color. I was going to do lashes, but I don't know if I feel like dealing with lashes today. I have my magnetic lashes. <laughs> These are also for sale. I guess I'll deal with them today. Why not? Just, just for that. I'm going to be using my magnetic lash set from Level Up. It comes like this. Isn't that cute packaging? You get lashes, you get the little liner, and it comes in this really cute set like this with an applicator, which I don't use. So if y'all like applicators, um, I'll show y'all how this works. A lot, sorry y'all, a lot of people have issues with liner, I mean with um, lashes. So I'm gonna show y'all a quick, easy way just to do your lashes. So I just paint this on like black liner I get it as close to my lash line as possible. And then I take my lash. You see how it has the magnets on it? I've worn these before, so there's like little square magnets on it. And you just lay it on while the liner is still kind of wet. You just lay it down. And it uses the magnet in the liner, there's magnetic particles in the liner. And then there's magnets on the lash, which help it stick. And um, you can cut them as well if they're too long. Like, I think this one is too long for me, and I should have cut it, but I didn't. I try to make it work without cutting it, but if you got to cut it, you got to cut it. <laughs> See, this is just the one where you just stick it. You don't have to use two to clasp. I started off with trying to figure out how to clasp two together, and I was yeah, I would get frustrated, but I would make it work. But the liner magnetic lash is so much easier, especially uh, if it fits your eye correctly. See? That quick. And I'm going to do the other one. Um, I have more dramatic lashes too. There's two different types up there. I'm gonna be adding more variety up there probably later on today or tomorrow in my push mark. I have different varieties and styles of the lash. These are more natural. And I just lay it, oh, this one has a little bit of mascara. I just lay it down right on top of there and kind of make sure the magnets are stuck to the lash, I mean the liner. And that's it. Voila. Yep. So, very easy. So, that is complete. If, like I said, if they're a little long, you can cut, cut them to fit your eye shape. But don't cut too much. Measure it first. All right. So now that I'm done with that, I need to set my makeup. But 
I do want to put lipstick on before I set. I don't know what lipstick to wear. Should I do red? Should I do a pink? Should I do charming? Do I have charming here? I don't know. My red. What do y'all think? Should I do the natural color? The natural. It's like a brownish orange color. It's like a nudish brownish orange color. Or should I do like a pink gloss? Oh, I have also my Level Up Lip Plumper. It comes with a free um, cosmetics bag that looks like this. So it's really pretty. So if you order the plumper, you get the bag too. It has a little strap on it. This is very, um, it kind of reminds me of the Carmex. Mm -hmm. So this will pump your lips. I'm just put some on before that goes. Um, it has like that Carmex feel to it, that minty mint. Okay, so now you said pink. Everybody's saying pink. Pink, pink, pink. My charmer lipstick is upstairs, and so I don't have it down here. I do have a pink down here that I might use. This pink is from Ulta, I mean not Ulta, Sephora. It's like a pink brown, it's called, it's just color number three from the Sephora brand. So I'm gonna put that on, it's like really, like a mauve pink. I'm gonna put this on over my, you like my earrings, thank you. Okay. Oh. I'm gonna be doing a wig try on later on my other channel. So, uh, why wig sent me another wig? And I'm gonna try on some other ones that I've already tried on before that I really like. Okay, so this is how it looks. I'm thinking I should mix it with a little bit of the natural color because of the brown and oranginess in my shadow. I'm going to take the natural in my vintage collection and kind of just mix it in with that pink just to give that little orangey brownish tone to match my brows. So this is a very natural look. I could go bold with a bolder color. Um, said Lovecraft pink. That might be too pink. Have I gotten my lips done again? No, it's it's kind of wearing off as you can see. But I am using my lip plumper, so they kind of plumped up a little bit. All right. How, how's that look? This is good. You saying hot pink? I do have Rihanna's uh, color in Unlocked, what do y'all think? Too pink? Everybody saying hot pink? This is too little, too, too unimpressive. <laughs> hot pink? This is too blah. Mm -hmm. Try it. I don't know. This is a hot pink, you know. Hot, hot pink. All right, y'all. Let's see what Rihanna, can, Rihanna's Fenty can do for us today. This is in. Where did I say the name of that one? Unlocked. Unlocked. So. This is unlocked, y'all. We're gonna unlock, unlock. Y'all like that color? Should I keep going? I love how easy it goes on and how liquidy it is. Uh -huh.
using the coronavirus as an excuse not to, to kiss your sugar daddy is going to be very helpful, isn't it, right? Right now, uh, oh, we can't do nothing. Okay, coronavirus. Did y'all see that Cardi B coronavirus? coronavirus. Y'all like that one? Okay, I think that's good. We all done. That Fenty is always there. So, yes. That's my color. Thank you. I push it. Now I'm going to seal it in with my Beauty Bakery spray. It's called Beauty Bakery Sweet Grace Baking Spray. Is your girl, yeah, all the schools are closed today. Definitely. I'm going to go under my eye a little bit and kind of seal in. Underneath this, like, oh, I'm so glad I did not drop that. I'm gonna seal in my concealer just a little bit with this yellow, just so in case I got any mascara or anything down there, I can kind of, and then seal in whatever I didn't see. Anyway. So, oh, I need to go back and hit my with that Bahama Bahamian goddess. Okay, now I'm ready. I'm ready for my close-up. I'm ready to spray. Oh, it burns! Because I just did my eyebrows like I plucked them. <laughs> Y'all, this has this feels like it has a little alcohol in it, just so you guys know. It does have a little burn thing to it, but it does keep your makeup on all day. Um, this one doesn't, or it's more nicer to your skin. I didn't know that when I bought it. So I'm going to do double. And this is more misty. So, FYI, don't pull it before you spray. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to let that dry. Put on makeup back up. Makeup back up. What do y'all think of this look? It's cute. I might show y'all my outfit too. Y'all want to see the outfit? Thumbs up if y'all want to see the outfit. I'm not doing it until I get, let's see, it's 131 people. I'm not doing it until I get at least 75 thumbs up. Okay, how you doing? If y'all want to see the outfit. Ooh, I see 42 so far. Thumbs up, y'all. Hit that like button. Guess y'all want to see that outfit. Okay. Ooh, I see 45. It's going up. 47, keep, keep, keep rising to the top, baby. 49, maybe I'll do it for 55, 55, 60, let's get to 60 at least. Sure, give us a twirl. Ooh, this house, 56, okay. I guess I'll have to get up. Let me go ahead and get up. Pulled my hair back to, uh, I have to glue this down. <laughs> Y'all ready? Okay. Let me go fix it first to make sure it's looking cute. Because you know how stuff gets when you sit down. You're looking crazy. All right. Oh, this is cute. So I'm on these paper bag pants. This lingerie looking shirt, this little cute floral scarf, this denim, and then the back is like Gucci inspired though. Oh, my hair. I made this jacket with patches. Isn't that cute? So, this is like, I don't like the material of these pants because it's kind of like bulky. But I love the paper bag effect and um, how high they go up and how 
loose they are. So I think they're kind of cute. I think I got these at Buckle. I think Buckle. Um, my hair looks better pulled up. Yeah, I'm probably not even gonna wear this wig today. I just did it for the video. I'm gonna have to do my wig review. So I'm probably gonna be wearing this wig. And if y'all wanna see this wig, tune in later on my other channel. Probably tonight, I'm gonna probably do the wig try on this evening on my She Was 7 channel, but I'm probably still gonna go live on She Was 7 channel for, you know, information and advice in a few minutes. So y'all go find me there. Um, right. So, I probably will put my hair back up. So. Thanks for the suggestion. Mm hmm I will be talking about this wig in my haul as well. This is the kinky straight wig. It's in my last wig video that I have on my She Was 7 channel. So, all the details are in there. It's from ywigs.com. Just go in. You can also use my discount code. Um which is um, probably in the description bar down there, Letitia. And then you get like $10 off your order. Where did I get the Bumblebee pen? This pen? I ordered this online. Uh -huh. um, just type in Bumblebee pen. There's thousands of them. You can go to Amazon, Etsy, um, Poshmark. Wish.com, any any .com, baby, they got them. So, yeah, me and Sasha made jackets, and she made um, an 80s-inspired Stranger Things jacket with all her patches, and I made a Gucci-inspired denim jacket with patches that I got from, like, Joann's in the patch section. So. Uh-huh. Right. What do I smell like, please? Well, as of now, I'm wearing Gucci Bloom, the gardenia scented one. So I smell like Gucci Bloom, baby. Go smell it. Go find it <laughs> in the store. <laughs> mm -hmm. Ever since I've been, ever since the kids have been out of school for coronavirus, I've been eating like a... When they're gone, I don't think about food. When they're here, I what's to eat, what's to eat. So, you know, I gained like two pounds. So I need to get that back in order because they're here for another week. I don't know how it goes with the children. Okay. You like Prada candy perfume? I'm too old for Prada candy. I'm old. Like, I need to smell like some, some florals and some expensive. Um, herbs and spices or whatever. Layla, uh, like I would have worn that in my 20s, but I'm old. I can wear something more spicy. Okay. Thank y'all so much for tuning in. I'm going to my other channel. I'll probably be there in about 15 minutes. If y'all want to take a little break and come back, I'll be on my other channel. Thank y'all. See y'all later.